And let's go down this. Ooh. Oh no! Welcome to the charge! I'm Sir Franklin, and we're taking to the field today with Resident Evil, the OG, and one that I've been wanting to play for a while. I'm excited it's on the channel, and I'm glad you're here. Let's ride. How do I like my games? Like climbing a mountain. Fulfilling, but takes a lot of work. Like going on a hike. Good exercise, but not too strenuous. Like taking a walk, you can relax and enjoy yourself. Um, I'm guessing this is the normal game mode in the middle right here. I also like that it's on a Raccoon Police Department paper. So let's go with medium. Normal. Oh, so cool. I love the character selection. Okay, so we can be Jill. Uh, oh, cool. Okay, so this looks like the costumes and Chris. Yeah, okay, so it looks like we have them from the original Resident Evil costume scheme. Or from Resident Evil 5, whenever they have that flashback sequence, um, it's that DLC with Resident Evil 5. Um, but I think I want to go with the original today. I really want to get into the, the OG aesthetic here. Uh, so let's go with Chris. It is worth noting, I have played bits of this game before. I have watched even more of the game. So I'm not going into this completely fresh-faced. I'm a big fan of the series, hopefully like you are. So that's why Alpha Team is I'll be a little familiar. Forest zone, situated in Northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. Found it yet? No, not yet, Brad. Brad the pilot. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. Yikes. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris! Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. Oh, poor Kevin. <gasps> Did he shoot the head on accident? We continued our search for the other members. There's Albert. And it turned into a nightmare. Why wear sunglasses at night is my question. I love the old grainy kind of camcorder though. That guy's jumpy. <laughs> He's a little nervous. I don't think I want the guy with the shotgun being a little nervous. That camera on his shoulder, that's pretty cool. Jill tried, I guess. I guess. Run. Run, Jill. Chris, the crack shot of the team. a long way to go when you're being chased by some zombie dogs. Enter the survival horror. There are only three STARS members left now. Captain Wesker, Jill, and myself. We don't know where Barry is. I don't remember where Barry goes. Is everyone alright? Barry. Where's Barry? He's... No. 
What was that? I'll go and check it out. All right. Jill and I will stay and secure this area. Chris? Take care. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I will. Thank you, Jill. The game volume's a little loud. I'm gonna drop that. Look at that. You get into the action pretty soon. Let me... Oh, that's cool. Is that a little... Oh, I see. It's interesting. I can't make it precise. Hopefully it's not too bad. Alright, that's just gonna be what it is. Hopefully I did that right. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so... Okay, cool. And look how fast you are turning. Alright, I probably shouldn't get used to that. Okay, so we have our knife. Our kniffy. And... A, li <laughs> a lighter, and that's it. Guys, we're gonna take on this entire army of the undead. Um, ooh, with just a knife. That's fine. Um, I don't want to take up a slot yet, because we don't have a lot of slots. So, we're gonna hold off on that. We do have a typewriter there. We know that's there, too. And like I said, I have played this a little bit before, so I'm familiar with some parts. As we get further in, we're really gonna have to figure this out, though. Big Resident Evil fan, though, so I have seen some of this before. Have played a lot of the other games on this channel. And if you haven't seen that, you can check that out if you want. Uh, but just really excited to dive into this. I mean, the remaster they did for this looks great. Like, the, the textures and everything look really solid. The lighting is phenomenal. Very happy about this. Let's meet zombie number one. That's rough, pal. Oh, wrong way. Oh, we got him. No, he got us. He got us. Throw him. Thank you. Stab him. Stab him. Just keep... Dude! Oh, this is a horrible start. Right there. Oh, I went right into him. I might have just died. Is that it? That was not worth it. We're already in danger. Oh, I messed up. The corpse of your comrade, Kenneth. That's rough. It looks like he's holding something. Okay, little piece of film. I guess we automatically get that. Um, That was not good. I guess we go back through. I I saw a video of the Survival Horror Network, which they do great playthroughs without commentary, if you like that. Sometimes I do, too. Uh, I was watching it, and they take that zombie down with the knife, like, easy. I don't think they get hit once. So I was like, yeah, I could do that. Um, turns out that they just made it look easy, and I'm an idiot. Man, that mansion's so cool. Wesker? Jill? Uh-oh. Where are they? Where did they go? I don't know, Chris. Tell me. Where did they go? Oh, we got a gun now, at least. I... I don't know if he lost it. I guess he lost his gun while running. I am not sure. Uh... Well, I kind of have to have this right now, because if I get 
hit, I'm in trouble. All right, so I'm trying to remember, like, I'm trying to think, where should we go? What should we do? I kind of want to explore back this way again. We do have the gun, so we've got a little bit of an option now. And we've got some range, which is important. Oh, man. I probably should save. I, yes, I would like to use the infrared. Uh, I don't know what all these saves are. Let's just start from the, start from the top. Go from there. I'm sorry, I've been, I've been playing some of the original Resident Evil 2. The controls are flipped. Um, but this is easier to kind of maneuver. No, 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 no. I don't think we want that right now. Uh, what, what was over here? Isn't there a... Is there a door? No. Let's go back this way. I think there are some herbs not too far from here, if I remember correctly. Uh, you know what? Yeah. Gotcha. I think this one's locked too. Yep, okay. An emblem of armor. Right. Okay. Do I want to go down there right now? Yes. Where does this lead? Just kidding. We don't know. Oof. The camera angles are so cool, and I'm pretty sure they pioneered this, uh, this kind of a way to watch a game, but I, it does throw me off sometimes, especially now that I've kind of changed the controls. Well, it's, yes, his throat has been worn out. That is unfortunate, Kenneth. You're a great guy. Fun seeing you at the team barbecues. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah. That guy's gonna pop up later, I am sure. Uh, yes. And then you as well. Yes. Nope. There you go. Large bird cage, there's a dead raven inside. Oh, oh, there's ammo. Yes, I would like that. Yeah. Oh, that angle changed on me last second. They're tricky like that. But man, is that cool. And the silence in this game is pretty cool too. Like, I know that the music comes in and out, but the atmosphere, so good, especially when this came out. Look at the lighting. I'm, I'm going to be geeking out about this the whole time. And yes, I do have coffee. Hmm. There's a zombie. There he is. Ooh. There we go. Description on the shield. Death is only the beginning. Creepy. Oh, right, 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 right. Ooh, a key. I don't know if I want to. I think I'd have to put it back if I did. Is there anything else? What's this way? It's locked emblem of a helmet is carved into the lock. Gotcha. I think I just have to put the key back immediately, which I don't want to do. We might just have to run past or kill that other zombie that was coming down the hallway. Uh... Kind of. Oh, right, that's the map. Hold. Okay, I did just want to kind of try that. Now we juke him! Just kidding. Locked from the other side, gotcha. Bro, is there another dude? Oh, we do need the arrow. I think we need this arrow. Ooh. Oh. That's fine. So it's telling us to examine. I think this arrowhead comes off. Yep. Aerodot, sometimes referred to as a poor man's emerald. I'm an August baby. I think that's my birthstone. 
right on. <laughs> oh, I'm happy, guys. I'm happy playing this. I'm glad you're here. All right, so we unlocked that door. Mr. Zombie Man over there. Wait, are there two zombies, or is that... Interesting. How do I... Can I reload it all? Uh-oh, uh-oh, wrong time, wrong time, Chris. <laughs> oh, man, all right. Oh, a dagger, because we can have that as a defensive item. Yeah, absolutely. Yep. Cool. Love that. I feel better having that. Just so many cool things they incorporated. Oh, is that how I do a quick turn? Interesting, all right. So many cool things that they incorporated in this game um, that was just kind of ahead of its time. And it went on to inspire, I think, a lot of games. I know we push this off because then we can gym. Okay. Now the interesting thing is we do have the lighter with Chris, I think, right? Yeah, we do have a lighter. We have a lighter with him, but the problem is to burn the zombies to kill them permanently. I think we need. There's some kind of resource. It's either oil or a lantern or a rag. It's something like that. Which I'm guessing, you know, we'll get at some point. Hopefully, some point soon. It's locked. Okay, so those things are locked. Oh, did I unequip our gun? Probably not the best call. Emblem of a sword, gotcha. Is there any room we can go into here? What about here? No. Alright, fine. Ooh. An oil painting in a large frame. The paint is dried and cracked. Because it's old and not cared for. That is sad. You can't make anything out through the darkness and fog. That's another thing. Love the descriptions in this game. I just can't imagine when this first came out, the impact it had on people. The sense of dread, of tension, that it could build. Can we go out this way? We can! What is this way? Is this outside? I do like the painting on the door. That's pretty cool. That is outside. I think... I think we use the arrow out here. Is this one? What am I doing? What is this? Well, I take the shotgun shells. Ooh, no. Not yet. That's nice to know that they're there, though. I love these angles. You know, you know, it took them just so much time. Hours, hours and hours and hours to decide what camera angles. The tomb engraved with a picture of an angel. There's an indentation in the shape of an arrowhead. Well, what a coinky dink. I just happen to have said arrowhead. I think we get a key down here. Oh, that's cool. Right, we gotta get different masks. And there's... Yep, there's a coffin. I think there's a book and we get a key out of it here. A book is fitted perfectly in the indentation. Uh, yeah, Book of Curses. What could go wrong with that? Wait, no, not, <laughs> I'm not gonna use it. I'm not gonna read! Examine that. Will I remove it? Yes, I need the key. Oh. I am gonna read. I lied. Four masks, a mask, okay, speaks no evil, smells no evil, sees no evil, and one that doesn't do anything. When all four fall into place, evil will awaken. I guess that's when the coffin will come down, and um, we're gonna have to fight something in there. It'd be nice if it's just like a regular zombie, but I don't know. I'm also really, I really don't want to use ammo if I can save it, but I'm a little nervous. Um, I'm a little nervous because I just did not do well with the knife earlier. What's this way? Just kidding. Oh, all right. Okay. 
Okay. What could we do next? We could grab that gym down there. I don't know if that's the play right now, though. Locked. Helmet. Gotcha. Different key. We, so we do have the mansion key. We can do some things. I just can't... I'm not too sure what right now. Um... How do I... What is this? Okay. I'm drawing water. Gotcha. Uh, maybe there's something this way that we need. I know... You know what? I'm gonna stop trying to tell you what I do or don't know, and we're just gonna play, because I know that gets frustrating. Do these stack, or does this go into my storage? Oh, they stack. Nice. Oh, oh, what did I do? I messed up. That's what I did. Again, I'm mixing up. Mixing up but ends. <coughs> Chris. Oh, and I ran right into him. Well, the good news is we had a knife. Oh, wrong way. There we go. I think we can shut him in there. Look at that. All right. I guess that was not worth it. Nope. Oh. Nope. Oh, I got to use that to get whatever's in there. All right. Wasn't bad. Oh, I keep equipping the knife. There we go. Oh, that can't go any further. Ooh, I might have messed up. Oh, he's alive. Okay. Guess he's dead now. Oh, no, 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 no. Chris, Chris, Chris. No, 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 no. There we go. Oh, wrong way. There you go. Yep, now we're gonna push that, because we need to get what's in that urn. The vase. Whatever it is. Can we get that knife back? Nope. I don't suppose we can. It's alright. Um, can we? Yeah. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Man, I just look like an expert right now, don't I? Okay. Can I get it from here? There's a map of the mansion. Take it. Sure. Oh, very cool. Okay. So, this is definitely going to be helpful. We got the map out of the mansion. Oh, nice. It's going to be a learning experience. Okay. Connect to the mansion somehow. Maybe. I use the mansion key. Okay. So, I guess we're definitely supposed to do that. Sculptures, bits of pottery. This looks movable. Boom. Oh, another dagger to replace one that I've used already. I don't know about y'all, but you see how the dagger's just kind of on... Ooh! <laughs> you see how the dagger's just kind of on his side right there? That makes me nervous, because it's like, what if when you're crouching down or something, or, you know, you're aiming or whatever... It just, it pokes you in the leg. I don't know where this dagger's been. Wait a second. Oh, never mind. Suspended in darkness. Love the descriptions. Oh, is there another one down here? Cool. All right. No? Maybe I move it this way. All right, what you got? Handgun ammo, nice. Yes, please. I know the key here is to use as little ammo as possible. We're gonna see how that goes. Really gonna try. Oh, this was a cutscene. Whoa! All right, it's locked. 
old-fashioned lock. It's rather simple in mechanism. Okay, I'm sure there's some kind of key we use for that. Look at this old rickety door. Nice. Oh, it's a toothbrush. The water still works. Well, that's good. You can never be too hydrated. It's full of dirty water. Remove the plug. Yeah! Chris is like, man, I'm handsome. Look at my chiseled jawline. Oh, a zombie. Yeah, gotta watch out for those, Chris. Alrighty. <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> And we're not going back in there. <laughs> we are not going back in there. That is close quarters. And we're already seeing how I do with that stuff. Oh. Cool. All right. Yeah, why not? I feel like we were supposed to do that. Or maybe they tricked us and we could have saved it for something better later. I don't know. Oh, we're outside now. Whoa. Sir. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to deal with you later, but that's alright. Fertilizer. Oh, we have herbs. How much storage do I have? Not a lot. Um, you know what? We know that it's out here. We've got several items, so let's hold off. I know I'm gonna have to deal with him later. But I just don't want to waste the ammo right now if I need to use it, you know, on something else that it could get me right now. Hey, let's go down this. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, man. Awesome work on the camera angle. All right. What's in, uh, let's go in here. I'll get used to the layout. It's going to take a little time, but we'll smooth this over. Don't you worry. What is this? What a lovely empty room. Where does this go? Ooh, another dagger. Uh, I will take that. Oh, I could have used an herb earlier. You know what? No, we're on caution. It's okay. Um, ink ribbon, that's fine. That'll stack. Might as well take it. Oh, 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 oh! Do I want this right now? I feel like that... What if, uh, yeah, I'm going to be greedy. What did that do? Why did that just, interesting. Why did it give us an option to put it back? Is it just if we needed like the extra space? Oh dear God, what did I do? Chris, stop staring. Chris, Chris, we gotta do something, man. We need... Okay, so we have to... We don't get to use a shotgun quite yet. That's fine. We're gonna have to wait. That's what it was for. They're so mean. Nothing of interest. It's fine. Trace of something burnt here in Anchored Smell permeates here. Interessante. Alright. Well, I guess we're gonna go back out and hopefully not almost die this time. I just... I can't get over how creative they were when this came out. This was the 90s. Was this mid-90s, I think? Okay, so the zombies coming from that way. Let's go in. Really did just pioneer a lot in the horror genre. The survival horror genre specifically. I'm just checking things out. This is very exploratory right now. <laughs> just trying to get a sense of things. Ooh! Pal! Okay. Oh, there's more. How nice. Okay, okay, this is a safer. This is okay. This is good. This is a good thing.
Oh, listen to that sweet, sweet safe music. Still plenty of kerosene left that we're going to use to burn them. Very nice. Um, will I take the old key? Sure. Don't know what I'm going to use it. Let's put it in this chest, and then we have that too. There are several things here. This is wonderful. Oh, look at all the stuff it gives us. Is this because I chose normal? That's very nice. So then let's hold off on the first aid spray. Uh, we can save, though, and then... Should I leave that handgun magazine in there just to be safe and to have something if I need it? That might be the best of all. There's a lantern lying on top of the supplies. The warm light makes you relax. Well, that's nice. Yeah, give me that ammo. Uh, let's... Okay, what is this? The flask? Fuel canteen. That's what we can use. Still plenty of kerosene left. No, hold on. Oh, okay. Yes. Nice. Okay, so is this... Okay, we can use it twice. Can we fill that up anymore? About half the kerosene still remains. But your fuel canteen is already... Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. It's an old typewriter. We can save our progress. Um, not yet. I want to burn this zombie out here. I'm pretty sure we're going to be coming back and forth here a lot. I don't want this to be a choke point. Let's get rid of them. Pal, stay down. I'm Chris of the Raccoon City Police Department. Stars. Dude, dude. Okay. <laughs> oh man. I should have started shooting sooner. Let's see, there it is. Yikes. Oh, wait, there you go. All right, so we don't have to worry about him now. But dang, that was not great. Um we had several other herbs. Oh, can't carry any more items. All right. I think there's a couple of zombies up here. Oh, wrong way, Chris. We can do headshots? Do I even need to burn the body since it was a headshot? We're not going to do that. We're going to hold off. Oh. Mixing up the buttons. I'm going back to uh, my Resident Evil 2 button layout. Alright, we're going to hold off on Interesting. Okay. What's in here? No knob on the door. Can't go through. Gotcha. We unlocked it. Okay, where does this go? Man, I need to start going for headshots, because I wonder if I need to burn them if I get headshots. What is this? What is that? Ooh. A very moody hall. Honestly, this is a pretty cool mansion. I love the look here. Um... Alright, what's in here? Man. Oh, we used to, Okay, where does this go? I might want to just go back and save because I feel like I have plenty of ink ribbons now. Oh, cool. All right. Look at that. Come full circle. That's another part of the genius here is that you can stay in the same space and have a lot of different experiences back to back um, and make progress and feel like you're really doing something. What about here? No? Nothing. All right. Chris, there you go, man. Here we go. We came from there. Is this another door? Oh, it is. What's this way? Ooh, okay. Loving the options here. I'm gonna get confused plenty, but that's part of the fun. Is that a... What? 
What was it? Looks like a log, like a no, 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 no. That. Is that a hole? Is that a bullet? Or like a whistle? Huh. Old-fashioned gramophone record is Jupiter. Oh, dear God. Hold on. There you go. Open journal. Pages are blank. Oh, this is just about the chance. Gotcha. Y'all can always pause and read if y'all want to. Just checking this out before we go and get our save on. Oh, neat. Okay. Wait. I haven't gone that way yet. That is gonna have to wait. Yeah, look, the headshot did it. So you can either headshot or you can burn them. Oh, this is so cool. I'm ha I'm just so excited to finally be doing this. I love that music. It's so sad and relaxing at the same time and, uh, and mysterious. They really captured a lot of complex emotions that fit perfectly for this game. An old typewriter. Save your progress. Use the ink ribbon. I think we shall. Wait. Yeah, we'd saved there, so I guess here now? Well, that's gonna do it for now, but I'm really excited, and I think that was a great start to the adventure in the OG Resident Evil game. It is the remastered, which makes it even better in my eyes. But so excited to continue, especially being such a fan of the series myself. But more than anything, I'm glad you're here to tag along for it. Join the charge. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing. It helps support the channel, create more scary game adventures in the future, and it means the world. I want to thank you for joining the charge today. I will see you on the next battle. Till then.